Oh my god, man. I'm getting super tired of this shit. Fuck, 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 fuck. Cool. Rage. Nice. Oh, what the fuck? Whee! And he crashed. Asshole. An you mack a bottle. Uh, fuck it up. I got the dragon scale armor. Nice. Shut the fuck. Oh come on. Mm-hmm. Let me alone. Hey, what? You like the paw oh, you man? Oh my fucking lord! Ooh. I got myself bomb. Oh, for not this. I don't think we're. Yeah, sure, I'm not getting a run now. Ooh, I took a ripper. Getting fair for his foot. Good, can't see shit. Holy mother fuck! Ah, I got an ambush! That guy not cool. Dang it. And. sleep. Uh -huh. Oh, ho! Oh, mother. Fucker! I can't do shit. <laughs> oh, I got it on my ass. <laughs> Merde. Dang it. Mom. Fucking killing me, man. Damn you. She sure is in her. Ah, there isn't she shit. Oh, oh, oh. This is getting totally fucked. I want those box, but I can't get them. Because of this shit right here. Assholes. This 
するのかなオープンブロックスタッフでブロックをクロスするシュートクロああ、グレイト。Very nice this is. Okay, box. Poison. Poison, whatever. Great. Is there something in here? Nope. Shut up, bomb all this shit. Leave this planet. Got one ass of bomb there. Only Lim and Rainbow can learn this shit. He's like fucking useless. <laughs> this will be cool. Again on Raimi and Lim. Come on, let me be the one raging people. Wait, done, but everyone can. Not everyone. Raimi Edge and Baku. Face limb auto healing. Everyone can heal this. Ah, fuck it. What better thing to do? Why doesn't he shoot the down? Ah, fuck. Like a poker. Nice. Do I have to go like this? Okay, I think there's a box here. Intruder detected. Fuck, I'm a guess. Fuck. Mm hmm. Okay, I think we are on the right place. First, we must buy shit. Hmm, I don't get it. This is weird, okay? How can we buy things even though there's nobody here? Buy things? You mean from this vending machine? Yeah. When you put money, you hear all kinds of stuff for us out. Is there something inside it? Or are you making it around with symbology? 
but you didn't use symbology. Oh, it's so weird. I don't know if you think about it quite rightly. No, Mr. Ash. By trying to find an answer, there's no wrong way of thinking. But it's important to matter by which one find it. A badger? Mm. Miss Lynn, your heart shape for type of knowledge is really a wonderful thing. I find myself deeply impressed. If you allow it, I will act as a guide towards your answer. Hmm, that's not good, okay? No. What is no good? Have you already arrived at an answer through your own means? I don't know any means, I'm just Lynn. No, Miss Lynn, I could not. Seizing to activate the proper protocol of sovereign rights will be disrespectful. Uh, but as a scholar, what you want, what you want, will you? Mm, if you insist, Mr. Edge. Well then, Lynn, will that be suffice? Yeah, now you got it, Patchy. If we have resolved the issue, then please allow me to return to the matter of hat. This young Lynn is a vending machine. Okay. There. We all better now? <laughs> Man, this is one crazy crew. Like. Look at Blackberry. Okay. Go. Back down to. I don't need the rats. Keep moving because I can't do much around here. Upstairs. Okay, what now? Turn around, motherfucker. Okay, this seems like stupid. God damn it. Okay, we're next. What? Are we done with you? Everything's good. Very good. Yeah, leave me alone. Damn motherfucker. Where? And here I can do shit. Okay. 
you, you guys are really annoying, you know? Ooh, booster one. Very nice. Very nice one. Mm. Alrighty. Oh, what the? Asshole. Another one. Destroyed. What the? Oh god, I'm gonna be mean to you, Shafter. Oh, where did I know to wear? Oh my fucking lord, I'm getting tired of this shit. This one also play on. Intruder detected. Oh, dang it. Let's go for the hero. There's one. Dang it. Ah, oh, dang it. Move my ass. They're looking for boxes. There's my prey! Oh, you son of a bitch! What? 
So, where shall I begin? Machus, how about telling us exactly who you are first? I am Prosivu Wasayam. I am Bachus Deed 79 of the Morphus. Um, what's the Morphus? It's a very straightforward concept. Just as you and Mr. Edge are Earthlings, I am a race known as the Morphus. Yeah, I see. Aren't you, are you all your friends, huge and clunky and all boom too? I may not, I may not look it, but I'm a scientist. I lost the use of my body while in the process of fulfilling my duties or repair it to what you see here. Your duty? You mentioned that earth. The destruction of the is of guidance, correct? Indeed, that is part of my duty, but not its entirety. Letting the universe towards a just future for the sake of the continued existence of all life. That is the duty of the Morphus. Hmm. Hmm, what's wrong? Your reaction does not surprise me. I could not blame you if you thought of us in a mega many posturing as some kind of supreme beings. However, we are not quite so arrogant. We are merely uh, acting to escape our own destruction. The result will mean safety for all species, but the Morphus are hard motivated by simple e egotism. I see, your lack of hypocritical selflessness does make it easy to sympathize with your cause. I am honored that you understand. Um, you just say you're acting to escape disruption? What are the epiphanies of guidance anyway? Are they so dangerous they could destroy the entire universe? I see you two have a hardship appetite for knowledge, Mitch Raimi. As you wish, I shall explain. To do so, I will need to begin with the story of the Cardigan. Until roughly 200 years ago, the Cardigan species had not even developed on speech. 200 years? Do you tell me uh, they built a civil like he might this in only 200 years? Common sense would suggest that would be impossible. That is correct, but then objects that rendered common sense meaningless fell upon their planet from deep space. The Empanies of Guidance? Precisely so. The Cardanian attained the anomalous rate of evolution and became a savage species with a blind faint in the epiphanies. The epiphanies not only warped the Cardanian's natural course of evolution, but also took them from their home. Their home? Indeed, the planet Cardanian could not once send, withstand the rigors of his rapidly advanced civilization and was destroyed. Possibly, the Cardian are now a very great people, with no land to call their own. That's kind of sad. I don't really understand, but losing your home is no fun, okay? I guess you might say the Cardian will themselves become the first. The Cardanians are now actually seeking a new homeland, with this fortress as a mothership. Which only means evasion, I take it. That is something that cannot be condemned, no matter what the circumstances. Quite so. And that is why I must destroy the Gregory. Gregory? We Morphus use the name Gregory to fulfill to the Japanese of guidance. I trust we have seen the mutated Cardinian? Yes, enough to be sick of him. That is evolution that Gregory brings about. Maybe reaching minds, maybe reaching planets, they attempt to destroy the universe. That is the Gregory's definition of evolution. It is my duty to destroy the Gregory and halt the expression of the aberrant evolution. Well, in that case, we'll help you out. Mr. Edge? Edge? As long as those Congress are around, what happened to Olympus will happen to Ray again, right? Proper evolution, the future of the universe. Heh. <laughs> All that's way beyond me. But if there's one thing I know, is that the pain our friend went through can be allowed to happen again. Mr. Edge, you're a straightforward man. In that case, you resemble Mr. Crow quite a bit. So it was crew after all. You two invaded this ship and strike these up together, right? My meet my meeting with Mr. Crow was a completely strange change. I detected strict scene from this ship while on my way here. That Lumox. Making us a warrior like this. Mr. Crow proposed that he and his crew join me in my mission to destroy the Gregory. But before even hearing my answer, he overtrait this fortress along with his entire ship. By the time I had caught up and stopped him, he was al already quite close to the central resolution chamber. It's conceivable that he might have been able to subdue this entire fortress alone. He sounds like a quite an amazing person. 
Yeah, it's like a more potent version of Edge. No, no. I'm not ending like Pro. At least I don't think I am. I've been saying that the Garnetta will equally tenacious. Tenacious. As a result, Mr. Crow, Crow Susan Egers eventually will surrender and will take him prisoner. Even so, I could not permit all of us to be killed. And Mr. Crow and his crew escaped from the facility while I create a conversation with a Cardinian. I can't believe you convinced him. It is as you say, Mr. Hirsch. At first, Mr. Crow was adamant about ending as he claimed himself. But he analyzed the separation for every available angle and made the best possible choice to prevent annihilation. Mr. Crow is a passionate man, but he's also quite cool headed. I imagine he's bringing my machine to end second. The Marvel Center of Operation as we speak. Uh, and eh, eh, two? I'll explain it another time. Right now we have more immediate concerns. We almost see it there. Yeah, almost to the Gregory. And we're gonna ask this under to us. <laughs>